Archer, is everything ready? The Shiremoot will soon begin. Will you join us, Eivor? We'd be comforted by your presence. Yes, I'm curious to see this Shiremoot for myself. I'll follow. When will the boat begin, Abbas? Twelve able lords of Lincolnshire have already cast their stones, but they have reached a tie. Four votes for each man. It now falls to you to break this impasse. Me? By whose order? You have earned the trust of our three candidates, it seems. Even our bishop has found a certain fondness for your hardy spirit. It's an important vote for your people. How would you counsel my vote? I value competent and righteous leadership, not foolish friends in high seats. Anyone but Hunwald, you mean? I love Hunwald, as I love my own kin. But I would not put a stone in his care without fearing for the safety of both. I pray that God guides your vote today, and not the devil, as I fear. How are you, Lord? Have I heard aright that you have come to break us from our deadlock? I have, Lord. Have you any advice before I vote? Lord Hundbeor was a bold and honest man, if somewhat reckless. I see the same qualities in his son. Therefore, Hunwald is my man. King Cheowulf's attendant, aren't you? Aye. The king sends his love and support. Whatever happens here today shall have his full blessing. He is learning fast. Good man. Grim, good to see you again. A hearty hello, Drenger. Seems Britain is getting quite used to the idea of Danes stalking her shores. Where do you fall in this contest, Grim? Elfgard is a friend of yours, is he not? He is. And a good man as well. But I cast my stone for the bishop. The bishop? That's an odd strategy. These Christians are easy to nudge about. So desperate they are to avoid a good fight, they'll agree to most anything a Dane says. <laughs> A vote for Hunwald will return the house of the... Bishop. Eivor, I must thank you for your fearless participation in our moot. I'm surprised to hear you vouch for me, Bishop. I surprised myself, to be honest. But I felt it would be a good test of God's faith in my judgment. Under my guidance, this Shire is crawling back from a decade of lawlessness. God knows the love that lives in my heart for the people of Lincolnshire. I pray now that he guides your hand accordingly. Quite a gambit, Bishop. Mad enough to work, it may be. Well then, I thank you for what it's worth. God go with you. A vote for Hunwald will return the house of the ferocious swan to its former glory. How fare you, Lord? My prayers are fervent and my will is strong, Eivor. If I am Elderman, I will bring joy to this Shire. There's more to good leadership than merrymaking. You must be strong and stern and willing to take risks. Of course, of course. Strength and wisdom and fortitude and all that. I shall rise above the peat moss of mediocrity. Have no fear. That's good to hear.
Good evening, Alfgott. Eivor, I hope it's not untoward of me to solicit your support, but I do need it. The vote is closer than a cat's whisker. It's a difficult choice, Alfgott. Know that I won't make it lightly. Good, good. But let me say unreservedly that I am the man who would lead Lincolnshire into progress and victory. I don't doubt your convictions, Lord. Three men, three possible futures. Which of these sad puppets will dance best when you call upon them? It's not for myself I must cast this stone, but for my clan. Who will serve us best in a time of true need? You can never be certain where you stand in another's heart. Choose only for yourself. All three have strengths and weaknesses. Humwald is not the most cunning or clever, but he has heart and spirit. Both go a long way in times of need. Lead your shire with pride, ferocious swan. It is decreed by this lawful Shiremoot that the Elderman of Lincolnshire shall be son of our dear and departed Lord Hundbjorn, Lord Hunwald of Lincolnshire. I... I don't know what to say. I thank you deeply, madly, Humbly. What more can I say? I... I don't know. I miss my father. I'd sooner see him standing here than... Well, I will do my best. For each and every one of you. Let us all raise our cups. A toast to our new elderman. Shiremoot's decision is not final, but advisory. It now falls to our newly anointed King Cheowulf to ratify our choice. To this end, we need not worry. Cheowulf is a friend to Saxon and Dane alike, and he is sure to approve the results. Our good and noble friend, Arvelswith. A septic rot has overtaken this shire. A sickness for which there is only one cure. Your grace! What is this? Nobles of Lincolnshire, stand fast! For the glory of the ancients, leave none alive! Of our trail. Hold on. Steal yourself, Lord. Mother of God! Another battle! Pick up our trail.
how that god welcomes a new elderman. This one's gone. Find those who still draw breath. Polish your ass, Hunwald. The ultimate seat is yours. As your war council, I suggest you waste no time in catching this grief tosser. He won't be far. We should first bury our dead, no? That choice is yours to make, Ultiman. Yes. Yes, of course. We'll bury our dead, then raise a feared. I am at a loss for words. A trusted man of the cloth. <coughs> I will pray for these martyrs and tend to the remaining wounded until the last man walks free. Be well, Archer. And you, Eivor. May God or... or the gods protect you. attack and in broad daylight what news Hunwald? we've learned that herevrith rode for the fort at anicastri following the massacre i have assembled a feared there quite a large one in fact they eagerly await your orders eivor you mean your orders selderman ah yes that's right my orders which are which are what exactly who can say ride with me to your camp and we'll find out together Herivrith was a friend of my father's and always so dear to me. I don't understand what possessed him. He invoked the name of an ancient order before his men attacked. I know exactly what possessed him. Do you? It's not a story for now. This will send waves of disgust.
Who's fetching the turf this time, eh? Don't want to freeze to death here. And waves of disgust through all the parishes of Mercia. Harifrith is a new and ugly stain on the bishopric. Your Christ was an interesting man, if a little soft. But stranger still, I've met so few Christians like him. Today has been a boon, Eivor. In spite of everything, I now know my father's spirit still burns within me. It's thanks to you I know this. When songs are sung of the day Lincolnshire was saved, your name will ripple through every stanza. Don't be hasty, Hunwald. One verse of our song remains unsung. The din of battle beckons. You pagans and your appetite for battle. I certainly don't share it. I worry what diabolical feast the bishop has in store. Don't let that poxy bishop worry you. With Eivor beside us, he'll be victuals before long. How has Acha taken all this? She and Herevrith were so close. She must feel as though the devil himself attacked her monastery. A poor lady. We spoke briefly. Her spirits were low, but her work carried on. I think she'll be fine. Manipulated by a man who should we be... Are the men of Lincolnshire! Remember it! My ancestors fought with the old kings of Lindsay. It's for their memory we fight today. You see, the beard will soon be ready for action. Give them me. Our warsmith has arrived. The Feards are ready to fight. Chieftain Eivor, can we win this fight with the men you see assembled here? If they fight with the bravery of double their number, we may. And is there room in your Valhalla for a ferocious swan? Of course. Let fly your glorious banner. Are we ready then? We attack now. Ready the feared. Our first task will be to breach the outer wall. Then we deal with the troops inside. Give them this me. battle will be... Mm. way to breach is with a battering ram. I should help it along. Pick 
picked up our trail. Hold up. Picked up our trail. Hold on. 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 Hold on. Picked up our trail. Hold on. Need to find a way past that palisade. An explosion could do it. Or I could try hitting it with a sprinkle. Picked up our trail. Hold on. Picked up our trail. Hold on. Picked up our trail. Hold on. Trail. Hold on. I, I got him. My Point me to the bishop. No one else need die today. He he's he's in the chapel there, hiding away. Scabrous coward. Let no one leave that church without facing judgment. <laughs> Picked up our trail. Hold on.
picked up our trail. Hold on. With me, here! <laughs> Up our trail. Hold on. died the day I hid behind these robes, this cross. To bring the light of my order to a wider view, I did baste myself. Clawed my way to the top of this common religion, full of common men. I should have lived as the ancients did. That's the folly of mankind, Hiravrid. We wallow in our failures like happy pigs in a sty of shit. We should have learned to enjoy it. Evil. Is he... Is the bishop dead? He bled too little and talked too much. Now he's gone. I won't miss him. But Atcha will need some time to grieve. Lincolnshire is yours to lead, Elderman. The hardest fight begins now. The din of battle still rings in my ears. I think I now know what it means to be a leader. Good. I would ask a favor, if I could. Name it. As Elderman, my life may be a dangerous one. For a time, anyway. Would you allow my Swanborough to take refuge in your settlement? At least until I feel all danger has passed. We'd be happy to have her. Thank you, my sturdy Norse berserker. 
The mead halls of my shire will be lonely without you stomping about. Our people are bonded now. We must look out for one another. Blast it. I am a horror with goodbyes. It'll do for now. Now it seems the wind calls me back to Ranji. Let's tell her the good news. The other side must be barred. You are a good boy. Ah, a new letter. Lincolnshire is a friend to us. Wonderful news. And who is our ally there? The boy Hunwald is the new elderman of Lincolnshire, and he has sworn allegiance to us. The loud one, an elderman? Well, should he ever wish to call for aid, he need only shout. I want to see the Alliance map.
My mind is fixed on Sussex. Basim and I have a chance to save Sigurd, but we will need an army. That is for you to decide. The more alliances you have, the better your chances at victory. I will go now, and I will bring Sigurd back with me. That is a promise. Good. I will send word to our allies at once. Meet with Basim when you can. He should be in Croindene by now. Red basket of Wessex, land of plenty. see oh brother did you forget she has half done yours here stop talking if you know what's good for you you wouldn't be the first man to fall asleep on watch, but you would be the loudest. I did not mean to fail you, Gudrun Jarl. It was only for a moment. I was so tired. As are we all, boy. We marched hard to get here. Still, let's not disappoint me again. You hear? My Jarl... I'm... sorry. <laughs> <laughs> 